Hello, brothers and sisters of light and dark. Um, alien greys who can read telepathically, vampires, ghosts, bats, and werewolves, and all sorts of beautiful dark and light creatures. And also neutral creatures, kind of like myself, you know, I'm more of a neutral spiritual individual. Thank you for listening to my video. This video is going to be about um, the many reasons why um, America won't be attacked. But there is a small percentage, okay? So, it, it, this year is the year 2015, okay? And there's a lot of news on CNN. And basically, in October, it's now October 2015. And then we're about to go into November now. And on CNN, they're talking about... Uh, the uh, U.S. destroyer is actually uh, floating near a man-made island near Japan, uh, you know, China somewhere, okay? Now, this thing going on with Russia, you know, also looking at the cable lines and you know, all of the connections in the underground water, you know, you know, it's more than meets, more to it than meets the eye, okay? You, you know, thinking our internet was going to get cut or something like that, that would be some terrible shit, right? Right? Right, just spiritual people, you know? I'm not talking about you Christians or your religious people here, though, but think about it, you know, Christian people shouldn't be worried about it, and spiritual people really have nothing to worry about, okay? But, um, let's get to the point area that, I can talk about so many fucking things, okay? Okay, and people are so scared and stuff, thinking about an atomic bomb is going to be secondarily dropped on America as soil, okay? Yeah. America would... There's just a small chance that Americans can be poisoned, okay? We already being poisoned now, though, technically. But a uh, nuclear uh, uh, toxic explosion, you know, chemical warfare, is very lethal. That's the fastest way to kill off Americans or any area you want, okay? You know. But let me get to the points here. Okay, the first reason why you have... Not, like, 90%, you don't have nothing to worry about in America... It's because of the diversity, mainly freedom, because everybody wants to come here. Okay, the first reason is really the Republican, or the Republican Tea Party. Okay, uh, you have to understand that before Lincoln, there was Christopher Columbus, who saw the light in the sky. Okay, who was driven here. Okay, to do alien, alien, uh, uh, third kind. You know, a UFO actually written in his memoirs. Okay. You have to go back, okay, go further, okay, before whites were slaves to their own white caucasoid masters, okay, okay, it doesn't, it's trying to get to the point here, okay, the Republican Tea Party is based on control, okay, because Lincoln, we skipped to Lincoln, from Abraham, from Christopher Columbus to Abraham Lincoln, and, and they got tired of having African American slaves or any other race working for them, if they can't profit in the best way as possible, like the Bilgerbergers, the Rockefellers, the Melons, or whatever you want to call it, okay? So they, they, they chose a modern-day slave instead to monopolize on, basically, well, you can look it up yourself, okay? They basically replaced the abusive, uh, torturing slavery with a modern-day slave. So now everyone works for a something called a currency, okay? So you can do the dot research yourself, you know, Abraham Lincoln... The man who faced to the, the left, away from his other white counterparts, okay, said, hey, okay, the Civil War will prove this fact, and they did. And African Americans actually fought with Abraham Lincoln, okay, so they can get their asses to work in another more modernized way, okay. So, Republican Tea Party is number one. Though not loved by majority, it's not really meant to be loved by the majority. You have to have a few people who are in control of their own mental stasis and their own monies. You need the Republican Tea Parties. You need that type of shit. Okay? And democracy only means that people who are not of high knowledge, who don't understand how it works. Okay? There's a strategy when you have all that money. You can't just have all the money and not know what to do with it. Okay? You gotta have Republican Tea Parties. You gotta have a democracy. And you gotta have independence and you gotta have conservatives. Okay? Use common sense here. You gotta have war too. As human beings are not too like, truly involved. But on to the next subject. Let's go, okay? Um, let's see. I, I'm writing a piece of reading a piece of paper so I can remember. Um, number two, alien technology. You know, we already got uh, bombers in there that cannot be detected by radars. Okay, come on now. We, Area 51, Narvada, okay? You, you see it all on TV. They're giving you information. Let me tell you a little hint here. When you're researching something, everything is pretty much on the internet for you already in videos and documentations and... And all sorts of reading, research is possible on the internet. You can even self-educate yourself, okay? 
when you're looking at something, you're trying to research it, you have to look at the number of views, okay? Because most people don't like listening to boring things, and that's where all the vital stuff is at. You know, you see a white man talking in a monotone voice, you have to listen. You, you got to be stupid not to listen, okay? But you'd rather go to church on Sunday. But I'm looking at my time, so I don't want to keep talking to you, okay? <laughs> it's five minutes and 24 seconds. Let me go into the next thing, okay? Um, number three, currency. Okay? Everything is ruled in America. It's currency. The British try to stop Americans. Okay? You see all that currency going on. Yo, somebody's thinking a little bit too hard. The Caucasoid race masters have been sitting there slaving and thinking of how we can control the whole world. You know what I'm saying? You got to have a mastermind. They lost it. The British tried to take over America, you know, but they're still under the Vatican faith. You know, everybody's under the Vatican faith because of religion. Okay? You, know, you believe in God and you see what I'm talking about. Oh, you're, you're an idiot. Okay. But you have to say there's a possibility of God. So I'm going to talk about it, okay? But I believe in the possibility, high possibility of a God. But I didn't say there was a God now. I'm on a different back bracket here. I'm on a different bracket. So we have currency, which controls the, the whole entire earth, okay? The next thing is, okay, um, number four, uh, sex, okay? Under the black market, okay? Now we have pornography, okay? Religion is first and then sex is second, okay? Well, actually, sex is really number one because everybody wanted to be gay and shit. You want to be gay? <laughs> I have no qualms against gay folks. <laughs> I scared my daughter. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> I scared my daughter. I scared her because. Let me get back to you. And um, let me get my piece of paper. Six minutes. I think I'm almost done. I'm almost done. Um. I say you want to be gay, and that's up to you. If you want to like up 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 the black IP or have gay friends, okay. <laughs> Let's see, sex is number one, though. Our religion's number one, okay. And then you have uh, oh, number five, okay. I wanted to talk about this to you, okay. In August 6, 1945, do you remember that day? If you don't remember August 6 and also August 9, little boy, big boy, you remember the atomic bomb? If you don't remember it, you better do some research on that. That's when you have to worry about nothing. Everybody's safe. You know, you know, an atomic bomb going to be dropped on American soil, okay? Because that was already tested around the areas of America. You know, I sent some videos. You know, you look on the internet about the test sites and the people who dropped it and shit. You know, they, they, they act like they have regrets. But, you know, instead of having more than 50 million people die, they drop two bombs and everybody's going haywire and shit. Okay? Because they attack first and then they, America's at fault. So if you think like that, I don't, I don't even want to just talk to you about it because you're an idiot. You're, you're an ass, okay? So they deserve to get you two, drop, two bombs dropped on their assholes, okay? So you do your research on that about August 6th and August 9th, 1945, okay? Hiroshima, Nagasaki, okay? So the last thing is, let me see, immigration, border controls, um, uh, so many problems America is going through because of diversity and freedom and, and money and and all this other kind of respect that everybody's giving love to America, you know. <laughs> okay, number seven, okay, uh, you know, border controls. I mean, number seven is inspiration of American values, okay. Everybody want to escape. They want to cry across the street and just kill themselves and get hit by our sharks and eat sharks and shit. <laughs> Are you, you still think more reasons why we go get blown up? We don't need defenses. America has something even more powerful than a tank bomb now. Okay. We already got like a few scientists and shit. Okay, so you worried about the fucking defenses in America? Oh my goodness, you, your brain is not really on right. Okay, okay. Snowden and all that shit. You worry about Snowden blowing a whistle. Okay, he's a fucking traitor and shit. You know, sometimes you need to cause wars and have peace. You know, you do know that. You know, that's a tactical, the tactical uh, uh, maneuver, right? You know that it's a strategy, causing wars to have more peace for American soil. You don't know nothing about. Uh, let me go into the next subject. Being upset, okay, China. Okay, you know, you know. Basically, the thing is, is going on. You know, uh, in China right now, in two, and, 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 and oh, my time is running. I only get thirty more seconds. So I gotta hurry up. Okay, November on CNN, uh, October, two thousand fifteen. They have a destroyer testing the waters with China with their man-made land. Okay, so you you think that China is going to actually hit them? Okay, and the last last thing is I told you about the possibilities of America getting hit. And we're not going to get hit by 
No Chemical Warfare, and the time is almost up, and it's almost 10 minutes, and then in November, remember, November 20, to, uh, October, November 2015 in China, thank you very much, brothers and sisters, for Light and Dark, for listening to my videos, and she is getting heavy, and this minute, this video is 10 minutes and 10 seconds, I've explained everything in detail, highest facts as possible, don't worry about Snowden over there in Russia, don't worry about the cables, don't worry about bombs, peace. Ha, 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 ha.